Like and subscribe right now, or this spider will crawl on your face in your sleep. Cheating is one of the worst things to ever do as a player, and one of the most embarrassing when you're a streamer. Not only because you are admitting that you're not good at the game, you're also getting money from your audience. Welcome back to Trending 10, and if you want to see more trending videos just like this, you'll enjoy this channel. First up we have Make It Day, who is caught cheating in Valorant. Now I'll show you the clip that got her caught, but first let me fill you in with the details. She was caught using an aimbot after many of her viewers noticed the instant aim from the floor to the head of the enemies. This was sent to the pro Valorant players like TSM's Wardell and Gen G's Player One for them to react, and both got a similar conclusion. She was using an aimbot. The crosshair placement just sucks, but then it instantly headshots the enemy. That's an instant giveaway. However, she wasn't banned by Riot and wasn't kicked out of her management. Following that, she was kicked out for her toxic behavior towards the players. Nice. Look, I'll show you the aimbot. This is aimbot. Look, look, look. She's aiming at the floor. Aimbot. Look, look, look. She hits. Look, look, look. Look at the look how she she throws the knife at the, the sofa and then it instantly goes up to his head. That's aimbot right here. Aimbot. See floor insta headshot. Ow. Hey, she she's hacking, bro. She's hacking. She's hacking, dude. What the fuck? Following that, Mr. Golds. If you've ever seen my recent video about cheating gamers, you've probably seen this. Mr. Golds was a Twitch streamer who focused on playing Warzone. He wasn't playing fair like many other streamers, and he accidentally exposed it in the August of 2020. Mr. Golds was bragging to someone in the chat about how much better he was at Warzone in between matches, fully oblivious to the fact that the menu for his aimbot software was visible on stream. Mr. Golds recognized his error after about 20 seconds of spouting crap about how good he was, and in the moment of realization on his face was priceless. He was immediately kicked out of Warzone and suspended from Twitch. He has subsequently returned to streaming, but his main focus is now on World of Warcraft. There's no chance he'll ever be able to stream Warzone again. Have you ever seen anyone playing like me? It's like, like, seriously. Oh my god, man. Miss Q Gemini, a renowned Counter-Strike streamer, spoke out against fans accusing her of cheating because of her gender, and her statements appeared admirable. Unfortunately, everything fell apart seconds later when she opened the cheat options box and began playing around with enemies visible through walls. Everything became much more uncomfortable when she attempted to blame the incident on Clara in order to deflect attention away from what had occurred. After that, things remained perplexing. Miss Q Gemini was reportedly banned by the Valve anti-cheat system, although she transferred her skins to another account before that happened. Her Twitch channel, The Jin, is now inactive. Overall, the event served another compelling reason for participants not to cheat. Stop shooting me! You mother f <gasps> Wait, what the f Clara, hold on. Clara, give me one second. Why the f is this on my computer right now? Where is this? How do I close this? Yo, Rock, I need some help because I don't know what I'm looking at right now. What the f is that? Like, I'm actually just gonna uninstall this game because f it. I'm not getting a back ban because of this girl. That's actually retarded. Up next is Mobidos. During the early days of Apex Legends, Mobidos was a partner Twitch streamer. Cheats were very widespread in the early days of Apex, as many of you surely know, and many streamers tried to take advantage of this in order to develop their names successfully. Mobidos, on the other hand, was using an aim lock, which allowed him to perfectly lock onto enemy players and fire his gun without recoil. Essentially, he'll have a flawless accuracy in a less visible way if he uses the full-fledged aimbot. So like many cheaters, he denied it. After some of his videos became viral, he was then booted from the Apex Legends and Twitch removed him off the platform. That's just embarrassing, to say the least. Work your way up to become a Twitch partner just to be booted out for cheating. You're all familiar with FaZe Jarvis in this one. It takes a lot to make the FaZe roster, and Jarvis is a very talented Fortnite player. In 2019, he decided it would be a good idea to create an alternate account with aimbots and post a YouTube video showing it off. Cheating is certainly against Fortnite's terms and conditions, and when a member of the FaZe Clan uploads a video demonstrating how much fun he's having with the aimbot, well, that's not a good look. Jarvis was promptly kicked out of Fortnite and all of his aimbot recordings were removed. Despite the fact that there were still a lot of re-uploads, he hasn't been kicked out of FaZe Clan. 
and he has since limited himself to filming vlogs with other FaZe members and his channel is performing better than ever. I'm not sure how all these things work, but he seems to have gone past it. And he was telling me like he can get aimbot on everything and I was like, nah, there's no way. There's no way you can get aimbot. Obviously, I don't want to have aimbot on my main account, but I'm pretty certain I have got aimbot on this account. Like, you guys will see later on in the video that I actually have aimbot. <laughs> I don't miss a shot! Yeah, they've given me aimbot. Oh! oh. oh. I'm gonna be insane in the game for once. <laughs> Whoa! Where is he? One of the biggest streamers who got caught cheating in game didn't necessarily need the help of the aimbot software to shift the balance of the game in their favor. XQC resorted to some old fashioned stream sniping to gain the upper hand during a Fall Guys tournament at GlitchCon, a decision that resulted in a temporary Twitch ban. Stream sniping is essentially the digital equivalent of looking at another gamer's display while playing split screen. Players can look at where opponents are and what they're doing, and use that information to gain an unfair advantage. Oh, XUC stream snipes. The kid is, the, is everybody's biggest fan. That's Poor guy. He has nothing but a computer in his life. Oh, Lupo, what are you doing? He's getting grief. Okay. Get the f off him! Get off of him! Get off! Lupo! Bro! Who are these guys? It's XUC! Losers! I swear it is, bro! The next guy on our list is Kid X, a top 200 ranked Korean Overwatch player and well-known streamer. Kid X was discovered using aimbots in the game, leading to a permanent ban. Worse, his account was suspended while he was live streaming. It appeared as if he didn't care if others found out that he was cheating because his use of aimbot was obvious and he made no attempt to hide it. The title of the video roughly translates to top 200 Korean players eating while streaming, and that's what gave it away because the aimbot is left floating around and hunting for targets while you're doing something else. Of course, this is an unnatural way to play. After getting banned in the middle of the game, the player was redirected to the sign-in screen. Zacubus is up next. In the case of Fortnite, how about another competitive player who got into trouble after cheating? This one was a little less evident than Zacubus was caught on video during Dreamhack LAN competition. He started talking to his friend who was also competing about where they were going to land before the match. Then during the game, Zacubus collided with another player, but the two did not fight. Rather, they simply fired at the ground around each other before retreating. The two players were clearly collaborating in order to get the placement points, and as a result, the referee dismissed them from the game. Zacubus tried to act as if he had no idea what was going on after getting booted. However, after the tournament, he confirmed he was teaming and the boot was fair. Perhaps one of the best things to do when you're caught cheating is to own up to the mistake and vow to do better. However, when Semper0311 was caught using wall hacks, a form of cheating that allows the user to see enemy players through walls and other objects in the game, he did no such thing. Instead, he claimed he had zero idea of how wall hacks appeared on his computer. Hold on, hold on, be quiet. The screen has the red squares around them. The screen has red squares around them. Uh, did you just end the stream? Oh no. Back in 2014, Titan Star player Hovik KQLY Tobin Masson was handed a vac ban, causing a stir in the video game community. Having won the ESWC 2013 with Clan Mystic, KQLY joined LDCL in 2014 and managed a top 4 placing at ESL 1 Cologne. This one was particularly shocking as KQLY was one of the best players in the game at the time. While he was initially denied having cheated, he went on to admit he had decided to give hacking software a try. Apparently, the developer of an aimbot software convinced KQLY that many pros were already using a variant of the software. Just take a look at one of his LAN games below. When Hidden in the Cloud was caught hacking in Call of Duty Warzone alongside a party of friends, he laughed it off and claimed he would simply return on another account when caught. Oh, and caught he was too. After clips of his cheat riddled gameplay went live, however, folks over on Twitter tagged Activision and Raven Software, the former of which responded and asked for more information, including a link to his Twitch account. Shortly thereafter, Hidden in the Cloud was banned from both Twitch and Call of Duty Warzone. Get a hundred kills, I'll drop a hundred dollars right now. Whack ass money. Keep your f money. 
<laughs> Dude, <laughs> I wonder how long it's gonna take to get banned. Dude, none of us are worried about getting banned right now. Honestly, bro, as soon as I get shadow banned, I'll be on a different account. It won't take me long. This is where we'll end the video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more trending videos just like this. Share this to your friends and family, and we hope you have a good one.